And Fire Guy Nation people thing my jiggers. It's Fire Guy with another video review. And guess what? Tomorrow is my last day of school for the summer. Before the summer. And because I'm celebrating, I and because tomorrow I gotta dance so I can't go <laughs> to review these guys tomorrow. I've got a brand new series I'm gonna be starting reviewing because I love these figures. Sure, these I, I think I just got like a bad quality one, but still, oh well. It's Halo Reach. Nope, that cheap. Yeah, come on, stay, stay. There we go. Halo Reach, starting with a two pack. Yeah, awesome. Come on, stay. Stay. There we go. And this two pack is Spartan Loadout, Grenader, and Expert Marksman. This, I believe, is the Spartan MP. This, I believe, is the um, Spartan Operator. Yeah, Spartan Operator, Spartan MP, which is military police. Now, this is my first ever Halo figures. And I really like these. I just don't like the fact that I can't get them into the poses I can get into with a transformer. But still, oh well. So anyway, now back onto the review. So I'm gonna start with this guy. Well, they came with four grenades, but I lost one. It's okay, because um he's got communicator here, so fill up that butt peg. Take out the grenade. These are fried grenades. Oh come on, focus. Focus! Oh, never mind. Okay, so anyway, these are frag, frag grenades. Wow, I can't speak. And they have some pretty cool weapons, actually, these guys. Here's a Magnum, which is basically um, a pistol slash handgun of um, the Halo universe. Yeah, I am, by the way, I've only played ODST a few times with my cousin because I don't have an Xbox, right? Don't judge me, alright? And, um, this is the DMR, right? I think it's the DMR. I'm trying to see where it would say on the package. Okay, it does not say, but I really do believe this is DMR. Yeah. This, I know it's a shotgun. I know it's a shotgun. And where's the grenade launcher? Here we go. Grenade launcher. But anyway, yeah. Now, yeah, this can come off. But it's like glued on. And my little brother, he took us off. So now, <laughs> You can take off this fanny, this butt pack, but I'm not gonna try. Because I bet I'm gonna break it. And plus, I don't have the strength. <laughs> but yeah, so anyway. On to reviewing these guys. First, I'm gonna go with articulation. These are awesome articulation. Sure, some parlings are not like a Megatron or any of the Transformers, but still. Like, I wish that they had an outward mo movement. Oh, wait, actually, they do kind of have an outward movement. It's not like this outward movement, it's more of like slight humanoid. Real human being outward movement. And that communicator just does not want to stay. I'm going to take that off right now. They have forward and backwards movement in the leg. Rotate at the top of the leg. Rotate at the knee. So you can really like have this be on a separate rotation. Um, really good kind of soft clicking knees. Um... Knee rotation, ankle rotation in both the knee, the leg itself and the ankle, so that means you can um and it has a rotating joint here. They so can choose between having it move forward and backwards or side to side. So yeah. Yeah. So anyway. Oh, and also they have toe articulation. And that's in the legs. They have no waist, but they do have um, an ab crunching. Which 
can also be used as like a little bit of waste. They've got 360 arm, outward movement depending on the um, arm pads, um, no rotation of the bicep, got a an elbow rotation, elbow joint, wrist rotation, and wrist, um, wrist joint. Yeah. I can, I can go like, Ooh. Uh, yeah, good, suck. Yeah, and actually these are better, I've seen, um, video reviews and photos of, um, the Halo 3, um, Spartans, and these have better, um, hands. These, as soon as I get this one to stand up, these, sure they may look like they're holding a cup all the time, but they can grip on either hand. Instead of like having one trigger, one the other one. But then that also means that it's harder to hold on to some weapons. Like putting this guy to the side. This guy's same exact articulation. He has two grenades on him for mine. But anyway, yeah. Oh, I also forgot to mention head articulation. It's got um, a joint here. Ball joint. So a ball joint and a um, swivel joint, I believe it's called. I just forgot the joint name. Whoops. Anyway, now on to the cool things about these guys. It's their interchangeable um, armor upgrade pieces. You can take off the shoulder pads. You can take off the head. Uh, there we go. Well, actually, the double ball joint. Whoops. And you can take off the chest, which that does kind of look like he just died. And you can switch it with another Spartan. Now, since I only have um, these two guys, I'm only going to be switching it with these two guys. Because I can only do that. Anyway, so basically, essentially, it's like... Because in the Halo games, you're able to customize your own Spartan. They did that in the toys as well. So, yeah. And this is kind of looking like an, uh Captain America armor. Like, if Captain America was a Spartan, this would be him. Oh, say can you see? Oh. <laughs> and then maybe the Iron Patriot. Might be this guy. Because of the weapons. Now, there's one problem that I have with... I've heard that these guys can get oily. I did not have, these guys were not oily with me at all. But there was one problem. This guy's toe keeps on coming off. So yeah, that's one complaint, but my, but it's probably just gonna be mine. And now, it's these guys with their weapons. And my comments about the weapons. Now, hang on. Okay, put these guys over here. I'm just gonna lay them down. Okay, so first, shotgun. This shotgun is practically made for them. Because even with the big bulky armor that cannot stay on for right now, these guys can hold it. Double-handed. Double-wielding. Yeah! Looks kind of strange though with um, the red... Yeah. So anyway. And... All of them except for this one. This one's um, weapon peg fell off and I lost it. So yeah. Basically, the weapon pegs allow them to go into any of uh, anything. Like here, here, here. And that's all I can find. Hey, wait one second. Nope. Okay. Yeah, but this. Well, you can put the arm pad. No, our shoulder pads onto the knees. If you like them that much. But anyway. The Magnum. You you have to hold it so that. You have to have it so that the um, weapon peg is on the outside. For two. Once again the toe. And.
And this guy's not cooperating. There we are. There we go. So anyway, yeah, you can hold the magnum. Put it into here. Grab the shotgun. Gonna give this guy a shotgun because I just like him better with shotgun. Oh, and I also gotta say something. I also really like the um the paint job. I mean, every figure actually has a different um where the wear is, so it looks as if each figure is actually unique. You can't exactly have like that mark right there, right? That's him tech spot. So on these guys, it's okay to have like crappy paint jobs because these guys are supposed to be in the war, and it's supposed to be crappy. This guy's like, oh, my leg. This guy's like, oh. Anyway, what's the grenader? And the grenader is in. I'm to hold the other handle. There's like two handles on the grenader. It's right here and right here. Well, I mean other than the trigger handle. Either way, still looks epic. I mean, you can really just think about it. Hey, say hello to my little friends. Yeah. Oh, no. I just activated one of my bikes. Ah! Okay, I'm, like, going freaky because, like, tomorrow's... Ah. Oh. The grenade just fell. Grenade launcher just fell. Okay, so anyway. Wow, this is becoming a longer view. So anyway, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then, DMR. Same business. This is actually a different one. This one is ever since, like, season series 2 of the Halo Reach figures. They changed it up. There used to be this loop here. Which caused it, like, very hard to, um... Put it on, put the Spartan's hand on. They cut that, but it's not mold. It's not the mold that they cut. They literally cut it off each and every figure. Because if you can see, oh whatever, it's like actually sharp, sharp right there. So it's technically as if they fixed it after they like produce so many. So yeah. I l really do like the Halo series, actually. Like, I thought that was only Marvel and Transformers. And no, I will not be reviewing any DC! Right back on topic. So yeah, these two guys, pretty awesome. Pick them up! Pick up the Spartan loadout. Pick up the Spartan loadout. And I probably will be doing more Halo reviews. Okay? So, Fire Guy, signing out.